DLF Limited is one of the largest commercial real estate developers in India. It was founded by Shaudhari Raghavendra Singh in 1946 and is based in New Delhi, India. DLF developed residential colonies in Delhi such as Shivaji Park, Rajari Garden, Krishna Nagar, South Extension, Greater Kailash, Kailash Colony, and Horse Cars. DLF builds residential, office, and retail properties. With the passage of Delhi Development Act in 1957, the local government assumed control of real estate development in Delhi and banned private real estate developers. As a result DLF began acquiring land at relatively low cost outside the area controlled by Delhi Development Authority, in the district of Gurgaon, in the adjacent state of Haryana. In the mid-1970s, the company started developing their DLF city project at Gurgaon. Its plans include hotels, infrastructure and special economic zones related development projects. The company is headed by Kushal Pal Singh. Kushal Pal Singh, according to the Forbes listing of richest billionaires in 2009, was the 98th richest man in the world and the world's richest property developer. The company's US$2 billion IPO in July, 2007 was India's biggest IPO in history. In its first quarter results for the period ending June 30, 2007, the company reported a turnover of Rs 3,120.98 crore and profits after taxes of Rs 1,515.48 crore. As of March 31, 2012, the company had a 1.38 thousand square feet of leased retail space across the country. Indiana, 2013-14 it leased up 3 million square foot of office space in India. Income, DLF has about 25 million square foot of leased office space spread across Gurgaon, Hyderabad, Kolkata, Chandigarh and Chennai, which generates a rental of about Rs 1,950 crore every year and supports Rs 19,000 crore of the company's debt. History, in the early 1940-1950s, Shaudhari Raghavendra Singh and Makanlal Jain Ganthawal of Rohtak, Haryana who was managing director of Delhi Land and Finance Housing and Construction Private Limited at that time, procured real estate around Delhi. The wealth generated was multiplied over the decades through investments like Punjabi Ban, Rajari Garden, Krishna Nagar, South Extension, Greater Kailash 1 and 2, Kailash Colony, Hawes Cars, and Pinchiel. In the 1970s and 1980s DLF purchased 3,000 acres of land from farmers in Gurgaon for $2,000 per acre. At that time, the Haryana government did not allow private companies to develop the land. Years later, when Rajiv Gandhi became Prime Minister, he ensured that the Haryana government changed the local law and allowed private companies to develop land. Gurgaon underwent a private real estate boom which is continuing to this day. The boom includes world-class office buildings, apartments, golf courses, shopping malls, five-star hotels and a private expressway linking Gurgaon to Delhi Airport. In 1985, DLF started developing the 3,000 acres it had acquired from farmers. In 1999, DLF developed its first A-grade office spaces for rent in Gurgaon. Joint Ventures Lying Erg is a UK-based construction company that built Dubai International Airport and London's Millennium Tower. It will construct all DLF's landmark projects. Nork Heel of Dubai are partnering with DLF for developing townships in India. WSP Group PLC is also partnering DLF, providing management and consultancy to the built and natural environment. Feedback Ventures is providing consultancy for faster project execution. DLF has also teamed up with Hilton Hotels to jointly develop hotels in India. Sponsorship In 2008, DLF became the title sponsor of the Indian Premier League, a newly formed 2020 cricket league. DLF paid close to 200 crore for the five-year sponsorship deal. The deal ended in the 2012 version of the season, wherein it was taken over by PepsiCo Incorporated. References